Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Um, we've had a real tragedy happen in our family the uh, last couple weeks. Um, my brother's wife, Natalie, we call her Nat, passed away suddenly and uh, yeah, it's really hit, hit my brother hard and uh, 23 years they were together. He asked me to go through all his uh, video files and uh, to make a, a collage of, uh, of Nat and, uh, and in doing so he, he gave me he gave me six SD cards full of, uh, of video um, and as I may have said in previous videos my brother doesn't do YouTube or uh, upload editing he doesn't do any of that he strictly makes these videos to save to show his uh, you know when we're all when we're all dead and gone, there's a, a little bit of history left there of uh, the stuff we did and things we were into and and that type of thing. So as I was going through his videos files, I was just like, man, this stuff's amazing. Um, it's just so real, so raw and uh, authentic. He's not fake. He's not he's not a phony at all. There's a lot of hunting videos, uh, you know, with, with him. That's one of his main passions. And uh, so I wanted also just to forewarn anyone who's not into hunting to uh, avoid the videos I'm about to put up over the next little while. Uh, there's just so much good stuff on here. Uh, I, I really think it needed to be uh, saved. And uh, so I'm go as I go through the footage to find clips of uh, Nat to put in this memorial video that I'm making for her, I'm finding all these other clips. I have to go through all the clips to find uh, you know, parts of Nat that I can take out and make a, a video about her. So uh, all that stuff's going to go up on my channel. Um, that's been the purpose of my channel all along, was just to save the memories, uh, show some interesting things if we get out and do something cool. And like I said, I just don't think this video should stay hidden on these SD cards. So, uh, you know, I, I love my brother so much. He is, uh, I feel so lucky to have him as a brother and uh, he's just an awesome guy um, you guys have seen him in my videos before so he is uh, well known to people who regularly watch my videos but uh, these are all these some of these clips are three and four years old that's how long he's been uh, been doing it but it's all outdoorsy Canadiana stuff uh, but like I said be forewarned don't watch if you're uh, against hunting or uh, seeing animals get shot or any of that stuff, that's totally what my brother's about. That's uh, that's what these next videos are about. I'm not really doing much, just working here. We're, we're just, I'm just working away here in Canada, just uh, running my business and stuff. So I'm not getting out doing much. Uh, I want to give my beautiful Thai lady, Tick, a huge shout out. And I love you and miss you, babe. Um, and I just can't wait to see you again. Let's see what else. My Rolling Stones video went kind of, not viral, viral in the uh, sense of the word, but for my channel, viral. Uh, last I looked, it was up over 50,000 views. Um, and it's, you know, for some unknown reason, YouTube finally decided to suggest my video uh, out there for people who are interested in this uh, Rolling Stones tour. But, uh, of course, I get... I finally get a popular video and thinking I'm gonna make a couple bucks. I'm gonna make a couple bucks, YouTube. Nope, not meant to be. I didn't get one, I didn't get two. I got six copyright strikes on that video. I put six songs, Rolling Stone songs, in the video. And uh, Sony uh, grabbed up my little $50 or whatever I was gonna make from that video. And uh, that's the end of that. So. It's just the way YouTube is. They uh, any opportunity they can. They, the corporations want to keep as much of your money as they uh, they can get. Um, you know, I thought they, even if they that we split the money after the the time and the effort of videoing and editing and putting it all together and uploading it uh, to give the creator zero it seems kind of crappy to me. But uh, so that's the way it works. I figured it out. The Sony records the actual concert and then they upload it into the YouTube system and so anybody with a cell phone who points it at that stage and records it puts it on YouTube Sony grabs the cash any any cash from that so you can think of the millions of views that is happening 
from uh, these these Rolling Stones concerts, that money is just all going straight to Sony. So it's a good uh, scam on their part. They claim, uh, of course, they own the rights to the music, but uh, and I understand that they they uh, but they don't offer the creator even a penny. You know, they just take it all, and uh, seems a little unfair to me. We're promoting their band. We're showing, we're showing, uh, you know, thousands of people having a great time at their band's concert, and uh, you know. So, anyways, that's just the way the corporations do their thing. Um, the little guy's always going to get squeezed out. That's just the way that they run. Um, but, anyways, I want to thank everybody for subscribing. I got over 100 new subscribers from that video, so it wasn't all doom and gloom. Uh, so thanks a lot for watching everybody and uh, I hope you enjoy this next round of videos uh, that my brother my brother essentially made and uh, hope you're doing well. Okay, take care. See ya.